Hey guys, it's Renee. So today I'm gonna be hand painting some artwork or just some drawings that my dad did. So the main artist is my dad. Shout out to my dad. I'm just painting what he did. I'm gonna be painting them because I'm gonna be using them for my next DIY. For the witch, I'm gonna be mixing this blue and this black. First, I'm gonna be painting the whole thing blue. Before it starts to dry, I'm gonna be adding some more black to my blue. And so I'm gonna be adding a darker shade of blue for the top part of the sky. Then just pretty much blend that and let it dry for my candy corn I'm gonna be painting this in yellow first and then obviously orange for my following pumpkin it's pretty easy self-explanatory just painting this in in orange then for this guy for my yeah, green ripper I'm gonna be painting just the axe is that how you call it in this neon green i do have the diy showing you how to make this neon green in case you like it and then the eyes i'm going to be painting in yellow with this dining tool i also do have the diy showing you how to make this and let it dry for my skull and bats i'm going to be painting this like the background into colors like gradient effect I'm going first with my purple painting all the edges with my detail brush always in all of this i added uh, some water to just dilute it so that it would just paint it easier and then on top of that I'm gonna be adding my blue again pretty much going around the bat and then just blending them like so just making it a gradient effect or just trying to then I'll add two yellow dots for the eyes now after I painted this because they're paper when you paint paper well, using acrylic paint or any kind of paint it will just not be as flat anymore it just goes like um, wrinkly a bit I'm just gonna be placing them inside a book so that the weight of the book is gonna flatten them and finally I went over with this roller ball that is the same thing that my dad used to draw this cute little characters this one looks like a pen but it's not it really is way more ink than a regular pen does and because of that it's really easy to just paint things like I'm doing right now I'm doing this with some of them just because I covered the whole thing in acrylic paint and just to make those drawings pop again but yeah I just wanted to share with you this because I'll be using them for my next DIY so stay tuned for that hopefully this was helpful and handy or helped you relax if you like watching people painting pretty simple easy details for Halloween that I wanted to share and yeah if you like them don't forget to give this a thumbs up and let me know down below subscribe for more and share this thank you so much for watching i'll talk to you later and take care bye